All right, we have a couple. Uh, Brian, should Tony Chimmel Jim be inducted Dog. into the WWE Hall of Fame? I call him Chim Dog. That's that's that's, that's what I call him. Uh, Tony Chimmel. Come on, man. That's a it's a no brainer. Tony Chimmel should be in the Hall of Fame just because of the work that he that he did. Um, his body of work is definitely uh, something that should be mentioned. Um, because Tony Chimmel was just a guy that you saw doing the ring announcing. Uh, he was a guy that was making sure guys got paid, you know, making sure the, the, the truck got, you know, set up properly, you know, making sure, you know, uh, you know, s- certain guys needed to, you know, do promos and stuff, you know, rounding up guys. The dude did a little bit of everything for that company for a very, very long time. Um, and, and yes, um, Tony Chimmel should be in the, the hall of fame without even a question. Um, he should be in the hall of fame. I agree. I mean, I, I could put him in the hall of fame from my perspective as a ring announcer alone. Um, I mean, yeah, yeah. In there. That, that's all you saw. You know what I mean? That's all that's you all saw. I saw. Yeah. And to me, that was enough. Uh, he was a legend. He is a legend, uh, in my mind, as far as the WWE goes, and I know this is sacrilege, and I hope that people don't just like blow up the comments and I get attacked on Twitter. I always kind of prefer Tony Chimmel's announcing to almost any other wrestling announcer. I just like how he sounded. He didn't sound like he was like like putting on a voice. You know what I mean? He sounded like I am I am announcing this person. Like I don't well, know how to describe well, it. even when well, he did the rated R superstar. You know what? Rated R. I, I, thought, I, I thought of Tony Chimmel like maybe he didn't think of himself like this, but I, I thought of him like Jimmy Lennon Jr. or Michael Buffer. Um, that signature voice that you would recognize in your sleep and you did not want to hear it any other way. Um, that's what I, I remember about Tony Chimmel, I think, more than anything. You know, more than even Michael Buffer, like if we were to make one-to-one comparisons, Michael Buffer is to Howard Finkel as Tony Chimmel is to Bruce Buffer, right? Yeah. yeah. Michael Buffer has that iconic voice. So does Howard Finkel. Yeah. I kind of prefer Bruce and Tony. That's just my personal opinion. I just like how Bruce announces. I like how Tony announces. It's kind of, yeah. you know, we all have our preferences. But he's yeah, yeah. Know, yeah, I think so. Yeah, I would I love to have Tony Chimmel at Reality of Wrestling. That's what I want. Hey man, like, we can make that happen. We can make let's that. Let's get happen. Tony down to row. We can make that happen. 